Hi everybody, I'm Dominic from Paintball as well. Today I'll be reviewing the Virtue High Roller V2 gear bag. Right, so this just dropped in into the shop uh, recently. Uh, let's start from the top. So from the top, uh, we have a good good grip on this handle over here. It's pretty thick, uh, high quality, reinforced uh, stitching and uh, it's pretty comfortable to hold as well. All right, so moving down from over here, we have uh, a few more handles that we can use. So if you're holding a bag from the top, basically you can use this to basically chuck it into uh, your taxi or your transport that's going to bring you to the field, including the back, the, right at the bottom, there's this uh, plastic that, that acts as, well as, as, as a stand when the bag is standing up. And you'll be able to use this as well to, to you know, put it into the, the, the trunk of the car. All right, so looking at the bottom, there is uh, uh, multi-terrain wheels. Basically, there's grooves in it. If you're going to pull it through uh, 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 grass or anything, it's going to take take that and uh, roll with it. And also, um, if you're in the airport, no problems. Very good, high quality nylon uh, wheels. All right, and the bottom also has a, has a plastic lining. Let's go to the back. Reinforced uh, plastic over here, which is going to help you if you're gonna go upstairs, escalators, it's gonna rub against the bottom, it's not gonna you know, tear the back material of the of the bag. And then uh, move on to the back. The bag is pretty uh, interesting. Basically what they have done with this bag is they have added in straps. So if you see this uh, zipper over here, if you unzip this part over here, basically it will reveal the straps. All right, and with these straps, uh, it also, I mean, as it, as when you unzip the flap, basically the flap is going to go to the back. As when you see, look at the back, there is this uh, Velcro over here. Basically, the strap is going to connect with that. I mean, the, the back flap is going to connect with that and hold it down. Basically, what this does, it, it holds the this flap against the wheels and the bottom of the back. So when you strap it to your back, you're basically not going to touch the, the dirty part of the back you know where, where the mud or whatever is it's not going to be on on your own back right so just uh, connect it over here and it connects like that and yes so with this you can now strap on your back you know if you're pulling it through the grass areas in your field uh, to, to the players area you'll be able to strap it on you know you don't have to, to force it through the, the grass or the gravel or whatever and uh, yeah pretty high quality straps uh, reinforced cushion, padded, uh, netted as well, so it's breathable. And yeah, it's pretty good. All right, so moving on to the top of the back. The top of the back basically has uh, the handle where you use to pull. There's uh, basically two, two, two uh, locking locations. And uh, the, it's actually made extra long. So you have, if you have a, a carry-on bag, something like that, which has the pocket where you can, uh, you know, uh, slot it into the handle it's basically made extra long so that you still have a portion for you to hold right on top over like that and basically you can uh, you don't have to, to have this to your back you can have it everything on on the, your gear bag as well including this uh, handy um, strap at the front this over here basically let me just move this like that right so this strap over here what it does is if you have a backpack like this, you'll be able to strap it on like this. And uh, you don't have to carry it separately. Everything can be connected and pulled as one thing, right? So very handy, very useful. Uh, I'm sure you can also put something on there if you uh, if a mask, a mask, mask bag or whatever, pots, pot bag, whatever. You can basically just strap it on there and you don't have to worry about it. Right, so now let's go into the pockets. So let's start with the first one. The first pocket over here is uh, is for your mask. Basically, it has a puncture-proof uh, material over here, and it has the emboss a V logo of the virtue. All right, so opening it up. Look at that. It's a it's a microfiber. So basically, if you have if you're throwing your mask in without a mask bag. Uh, this is not going to scratch your lens. No, it's all all lined with microfiber. Even the top here, and then this front part is actually a uh, uh, top uh, material. It's waterproof, so no, no, no. If it gets uh, 
rained on or whatever, it's not going to go into the bag. It's not going to be sealed up, and uh, your mask is going to be safe inside. All right. So going to the to the pocket just uh, behind this over here. So this uh, this is actually part of the main compartment already, but it's separate from the main compartment. Basically, uh, it is uh, adjustable. Basically, this this portion over here can move into the lower part of your bag or or not. So basically, if you have wet clothing, you have muddy clothing, shoes, anything, you can throw it over here, and this is gonna stay within this portion of the bag. And uh, yeah, if you need it bigger or smaller. Uh, it will just automatically adjust based on how much you put in right so this is as i mentioned connected to the main portion let's before we go into the main portion let's talk about the few pockets that they have uh in front as well uh just also to mention that there is a, a velcro patch here so if you want to customize your bag the whole team might be using the same bag so it's good to have something on here like a, your number or your name or just a, a you know a patch which you can recognize as your own so that you'll be able to identify, identify which bag is yours right so you can paste it over here and when we go into the, for this first pocket it's uh same waterproof uh, lining and then this bag is pretty big uh and yeah you can hold some documents maybe maybe your layout some a4 pieces of paper uh travel documents even this would be good handy for that and then if uh just behind there there's an even bigger portion right so this is a whole basically it was uh, more than half of the bag but it's pretty um, slim so it's a slim compartment something big that you can put on here maybe a folded uh, clothes or something that, that you want to stay out of uh, the main compartment this is a good place to put it you know, everything is lined as well with the waterproof uh, lining and then going to the main compartment which is uh, 120 liters so this is the main compartment just turn it over this way oops so this is the main compartment everything is also lined with waterproof lining uh, there's two new print padded pockets on the on the left and right over here as well which you can put some stuff like your your marker or something that you want to have it vertical and not uh you know overlapping any of your info of your equipment inside here and uh, in this pocket also it's pretty handy you basically have a netted portion like this is the netted portion there is a transparent pocket over here maybe for your id tag or your your wallet or your handphone something that you need to see but you don't want to get no wet anything here wet onto here as well this is a great pocket uh, and also a fully covered pocket over here with all the waterproof lining and so yeah nothing is gonna liquid from any part or smell or anything it's not gonna move from any part compartment to another right the side has also a long pocket angled pocket over here this uh, allows you to put something long maybe a, a barrel swab or something that you can put vertically over here and uh, it's not, not going to be uh, easy accessible from the back from the from the outside of the bag all right so the same for the other side of the bag it also has the same angle pocket this is the virtue high roller v2 gear bag new and improved second version already uh, new and improved uh, uh, and customized parts and it's yeah definitely uh, uh, it's available at paintballer uh get it online or you can drop off drop by the flagship store here in singapore at commonwealth uh, and uh, pick this up it's available in this color uh, which is graphic black and uh, yeah if you want the price go on to our website paintballersworld.com and check this out thank you for watching